So, I fell to my death. Let's go this way. Because, why not? What's over here? Where? What? Where are you guys? Oh, are you over there? Probably prevent access to the mine proper out of working hours. Something like that won't open without power. Well then, I can taunt you. Foolish canine. Where'd you go? Oh no, he, he went away. He went around the thing. Shit. See, what is that? Is that like a dog cam? Doesn't serve much purpose these days. Oh crap. What's this? Hey, what's that? Oh. Uh oh. Shut. Shut it. Shut. Don't come in here, stupid dog. Hey, the, the box. There's, there's more boxes. Fuses? It says 50 amp fuses, but the box is empty. Still, the contents can't be far away. Well, there are batteries right here. <laughs> okay. Um, what, what does it say on the side? Be careful. Well, I was playing on being reckless, but wow, there's lots of stuff over here. Emergency procedures pamphlet. Great, it's a two page pamphlet with, oh God, Morse code? Am I gonna have to decipher Morse code? In the event of an emergency, all mine workers are asked to follow the standard emergency procedure detailed in the leaflet provided. Rescue services, will already be on their way, and so under no circumstances should employees attempt to aid colleagues themselves or contact the emergency services. This code sheet is provided for use in the extremely unlikely event that you are trapped in the mine, with no way in which to signal or otherwise contact emergency crews. In this scenario, you should... <clears throat> Number one, ensure the stability of surrounding environment by gently tapping and feeling the rock. Two, once you feel certain that there is no risk of rock slide, check to see if you have any form of communications device at hand and attempt to send a distress signal using this code sheet. Should such a device be unavailable or damaged, begin firmly tapping out a message on the wall of the cave. Rescue crews will hear you and arrive promptly to dig you out. Somehow I don't think that there are any rescue crews. But... Thanks for the... Okay. Thanks. Hmm. Oh god, I really hope I don't have to do any Morse code. See you later. Alright. Be careful. No, I won't. It take it. What is this stuff? What? Beef jerky? I've got five beef jerkies. Put the glow stick. I like the... I like the glow from the glow stick. So what? Uh, yeah. Destroyed. The fuses are inside the boxes. No, they aren't. They really aren't. What do you mean they can't be far away? Oh, I see. Okay. I see. Hey, get... All right, come here. There's, there's one up there. I knew it. I knew it. I'm so smart. What? Take it, you idiot. Is, that, is there only one? Great. Standard 5x5 five five volt fuse. Hooray. Well, I guess that's all that's in this area. <sighs> These are just to go up there. This is a broom. Whoa! I actually, whoa! I didn't know that that was an acquirable item. Looking around, I'm not sure this broom saw much active duty. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh god, we're gonna equip that to four. Although I'd much rather have the pickaxe out. Come on, come on now. All right, where's this stupid dog? I can put my glow stick away. Don't even think about it, stupid dog. I'll kill you. <sighs> Shut it, man. Oh, he's just over there. Auxiliary shaft is that way. We've also got storage and excavation. Hmm. Ugh. 
What is this little... I saw another one of these boxes. What do they... What do they do? Are these just, like, places to hide? Or I can, like, lure the dog inside. Right? Hmm. fuck was that? I got the comm radio. That beeping coming from the speakers. Maybe there's someone out there after all. Are you, are you telling me I have to do Morse code? What did I just do? Well, I guess I turned it on. Hey! Hang on a second. These spare radio parts didn't look spare at all. They almost look like they've been put here recently. Hmm. Oh, hey, I'm stealthing. Eh. Nope. Hmm. What are these for? Okay, I guess they're just here. Okay. Hey. Get. So what's going on here? What's this note? 12th of January, 1972. Boys. I'd come have a word with you myself, but I've got more important things to do than piss about making sure you're all doing your jobs properly. Now I know there's a certain amount of camaraderie between you lot, playing pranks and jokes on each other. It comes with the territory and that's fine, so long as you don't add me to your list. God knows you need something to keep you entertained down here. However, all you know full well that Penrose has some very deep seated issues with his height. So anyone who thought it'd be a good idea to sabotage his generator, then hide all the spare fuses on the top shelf in the storeroom, would quite clearly need his head examined. You get me? In other news, Jones, I want that inventory done yesterday. And the rest of you, it's not all funs and games, you hear? On a serious note, another radio's gone missing, and you better hope to God that means one of you's lost it, because stealing ain't a pretty word in my book. It's the third one this month, which means the amnesty on coming clean is uh, fast coming to a close. Then there'll be repercussions, got it? Now what's strange is you're all supposed to be working in pairs, so nobody should be able to get their hands on a radio without the other spotting it. When I find out who's responsible, I'm going to find out how they got away with it so long then I'm going to fling them out into the snow and leave them there. They'll just disappear into the night, just like all those radios. Love Harvard, lead mine foreman. Here's, here's the foreman. Okay, so what the, what do I do? Wait, what was that? There was an eyeball. I was moving my mouse around and it was like, hey, look at this. What was that? What did you see? Oh, oh, oh. That noise, for some reason, I don't really like it. I've got to get a grip. Turn off. Easy. Easy, you idiot. So how do I use this Morse code thing? How do I use it? This is ridiculous. Okay, it's a narrow band communications radio. Huh. I remember building one of these in my first electronics class. Probably did a better job of it as well. Well, aren't you just cocky as shit, Philip? Fuck you. All right, I'm gonna go back to that power room and hope that f freaking dog doesn't get me. Oh, what's that? From the look of it, this mine was built sometime after the section I've just come from. They must have forgotten about all the old equipment back there when they built this place. Must have. Let's see. Ooh, so I can stand up here and drop stuff on the dogs. Ow! So that actually hurts, but I'm still as fit as can be expected. Ooh! Just like everything else down here, it's old decaying and not working. Okay, I get it. Automatic gate blocking out the rest of the mine needs some power for another thing. Okay, we get it. Everything's dependent on power. Propane gate. Okay. Ooh. So I could probably kill the dog with it. And hey, what you gonna do, dog? Finally get a close look at you. Hey, you want some meat? Check it out. You just... No. Oops. 
Well, let me just pick it up. And throw oh, it to you. Eat it. Look at him. He's eating the ground. <laughs> Feed the dogs. Beep. I, I, that's, I don't really know the rest of that song. <sighs> it's from Mary Poppins. In case you didn't get the reference. Okay, so I found a fuse. Hey. These days, a cable this thick could power city block. It's cold, so there's no current. Wait a second. Wait, wait, wait. Where's the... What? What the... Where's it go? It just goes... To nowhere. Alright, time to solve some puzzles. Aha! Haha! <laughs> yes! I was right. At the end of the last episode, I was like, I have to break this crate. Perfect. Okay, don't fall down this time, you idiot. I'm talking to myself, so calm down. All right, so what is in this thing? A giant battery or something? Of some kind? All right. Shut it. Okay, so I got a spare battery, great. Time to put it away, and uh, also time not to fall down. I can't, I still can't believe that happened. Nope! Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm losing blood, but I should be okay. Just take some Tylenol. Oh my god. I just wanted to break that uh, fence so I could properly... Ugh. So it wouldn't block me from... Getting off. Ugh, okay. This is bothering me though. I wanna get rid of it. I don't know why. Yeah, I wanna break you guys too. They're just unbreakable! Damn! All right, so, what's the deal here? This should have sparked the starter motor. I suppose I can't get by without a battery after all. Okay, so this is where the battery goes. Okay, battery in, startup motor functional. We should be set. What? That's how it... That's how it goes in? I guess I missed something. Okay. So, the fuse... Oh, not the comm radio, sorry. The fuse. Where does the fuse go? Fuses look A1 to me. Where does the fuse go? Hydraulics... Fluid control. Definitely at a loss on this one. A symbol for water? The symbol's worn out, but I should be able to work out what all this does. Could be the letter I. Really? Huh. Okay, maybe, does the fuse go in this thing? Hmm. Okay. Well, I have a fuse, and I don't really know where it goes. Maybe back here? No, of course not. You guys are gonna suffer through all of this with me. Or maybe I'll just edit in a song while I figure it out. This generator's age, it's a wonder. What? Something's gone wrong with the star motor. I need to get that fixed. What?
my god. I don't know why. Look at the hand, look at it move. Success. Okay, so the power is on. Finally. Whew, that was crazy. I'm gonna save, because I don't want to go through that again. <laughs> All right, so now that the power's on, should be able, oh, oh, good. It's all lit up. Perfect. I don't even need the glow stick anymore. Where's that stupid? Good day. Good day, can you hear me? What? What? Well, I hope that your ears are working better than your tongue so that you might use them to listen to my words. You have turned on the light at the end, beginning and middle of the tunnel, but some things remain shrouded in darkness. My Morrissey message I hope has helped, but what you need now is to the wall hole to the right of the fence. Oh, go now, there is no time to explain. Well, in fact, time is one of the few things we have in abundance down here. Most surprises are spoiled by such catty curiosity. What? Who was that? What the hell is going on down here? God damn it, this radio is useless. Who was that? Beyond the fence to the right, there should be a hole or perhaps an access point to reach further into the mine. Fence? What are you talking about? 